men are born equal, but predestination has made some born into wealth and others into poverty. We have no control over who our parent will be or where our parent will come from, which makes some privileged and others less privileged. One thing we can control is our destiny and destination. Out of these come Jokodolu Foundation. Jokodolu Foundation is a non-profit making a non-governmental organization that is involved in assisting indigent students from my constituency in Obumosho and Oyo State in general. Knowing that we are not born equal, Mulikat Adiola Konde, inspired by her father who was a philanthropist, naturally loves to provide support and assistance to any less privilege that comes her way. She has made it a part of her life and has been doing so long before it was formalized. Uh, the foundation is particular about, you know, enabling young indigent students, you know, to be able to have access to good quality education. Uh, we know nowadays that it is very difficult for students in schools to be able to pay their tuition through school. And so this foundation is on hand to ensure that most of these students, you know, are assisted through school. Because I believe that if you, once the tuition is paid, then nobody can stop you from attending lectures, which is very important before you even sit for the exam and all that. Also, we take care of widows because we know that these women are left there after the death of their husbands to take care of their children on their own. And so we try to bring succor to them by, you know, empowering them engaging them, you know, so that they can be self-sustaining and be able to send their little ones to school or at least even feed their families. In 2008, she decided to make it a full-fledged, formal, non-governmental organization geared towards providing support for the less privileged. An NGO with a future vision in mind, a vision to have a well-established foundation that will surpass her lifetime Hence, Jokodolu Foundation. Jokodolu, from her parental background, is a family name. Literally, Jokodolu means sit down and await wealth. And I grew up into a family, a polygamous home, uh, where love was, uh, I believe love is abundant because we still share love up to today. We're all very close, closely knitted family and we're a family that believes in sharing whatever we have. You know, my father was uh, a very quiet philanthropist, you know, in his days. And uh, I'm v I look very much like my father, so people believe that I've taken this, you know, from him. Jokodolu Foundation was established in 2008 as a non-profit, non-governmental organization aimed at primarily helping educationally and economically disadvantaged students continue their education through financial aid for secondary and post-secondary tuition and non-tuition expenses. My name is Oloiwa Jumudasil. I attend Lado Kiakitola Investor of Technology. For my P degree to the present now, so that is six years. So and then, apart from my school fees, I still benefit from her about the youth empowerment. So now, with, with, a, with a little knowledge that I have in that training and then in the school, so if I combine two of them together, so I can stand on my feet to stand alone. I'm an orphan. I met Alaja Mulika Akande Adeola two years ago, and I told her about my life. So she she's ready to help me financially, academically, and morally. So she has started paying my school fees. The foundation also provides welfare for the less privileged, skill acquisition, equipment and tool for small scale enterprises. <laughs> Institute of Nigeria. 
emi gangan ti mo soro yi mo ti bere pelu igun sisin mo se ni igbagbo pe ngba to ba fi to ipare odun yi olorun ti gbe mi dide ju bi mo ton ti wa yi lo last year we, we trained about 150 youths you know in the agri sector at um, Ibadan Cream in Ibadan and we gave them startup capital of about 100,000 naira each for them to be able to set up you know what they have learned at the institute train a man on how to fish and he will feed the nation the vision of the foundation is to train and provide skill whether formally or informally for those in need the vision of the foundation is to enable um, less privileged children in my constituency and uh, Oyo state to be able to achieve their dreams through our help or assistance you know with their education and or making them self-sustaining in life. I happen to be one of the luckiest students that have been just concluded and scale acquisition organized at Ibadan in collaboration with Coin. Um, my field of study there was animal rearing that is grass cutter. It's a very good thing organized by another Molika and we are still looking forward for something like that or better than. Jokodolu Foundation uses an integrated approach that will create a wider impact than simply improving the livelihood options of its beneficiaries by embarking on an economic mission to influence the livelihood options available to the poor. Where selected people are trained in certain skill acquisition, some people are provided with empowerment tools and machinery. Our economic mission platform is built to operate a series of social enterprises as income-generating venture where surplus income is put towards our programs. <laughs> But one for me, dry a dry come on, not tell After that, one for me, it's one. It be dry at one for me, but motor theory or wool to move around another dry a con, dry at the moon. Look, more do come here all along for the Bumble Cat Academia for machine, it's all good for me. It be motor physician, Mosira Bajad, Latale, Marcel Tibo, Modern Tony and Lu. So, motor be galati. The foundation has operated, you know very quietly over the past um, four years and uh, that is you know why we want to have this launch so that more people will know about the foundation and more people can benefit and uh, we definitely at the I can see the foundation growing to an extent that we may need to have collaborators or corporate partners who are willing who share our vision and want to you know partner with us for the past four years, Jokodolu Foundation has been self-sponsored, inspiring, supporting and assisting a few hundred less privileged. Okay. For 2013, Jokodolu Foundation will 